All right, hey everyone. I know I haven't made a video in a very long time, and so I want to take these few moments to share my thoughts as to why I wasn't creating, and yeah, what's been going on in my head, and why I decided to create a video right now. For the longest time, I've been wanting to create, I've been wanting to grow my platform, but then there would just be these thoughts like, oh, do you even know what to create? Do you even have you know, the best camera to use or the best equipment to use or the best environment to create? And all of these reasons as to you know, why I shouldn't try, why it won't work, why it's not gonna happen. And before I'd even take the step of trying to create, I would just be discouraged because I think, nah, it's probably not gonna work. Like even right now, there's background noises, there's cars passing by. I am my, like my setup right now is I have a table with shoe boxes on top of each other and that's what's being used to hold this camera. And there's so many reasons as to why, again, it's not gonna work. But it was very timely because a few days ago, I was reading this book called The Artisan Soul by Erwin McManus and there's a few things here that really caught my attention. So one of them says this, to do our greatest work, we must overcome the temptation to be afraid or become discouraged, engaging the creative process with strength and courage. And I was like, that's so true. And then, then there's this other verse, there's a verse that came up actually that he, that he quoted. And again, for me being someone that uh, really has value for faith. This verse really spoke to me. First Chronicles 28 verse 20. So David was talking to his son Solomon who had this task of rebuilding the temple, which was a very big thing for the people of Israel. So David said this to him, be strong and courageous and do the work. Do not be afraid or discouraged for the Lord my God is with you. So he says, be strong and courageous. And then he says, do the work. And for someone like me, it's like, you know, you think of all the reasons again as to why it's not gonna happen, why it's not gonna work. And then, and I'm, and I'm, I was just going through this thing in my head. I've been wanting to create, I've been wanting to do all these things but I'm never even doing the work. I'm just getting stuck in my head. And again, this ties to another thing, which I wrote um, at the beginning of the year. It was kind of like a phrase that I wanted to go by as I go throughout the year. And the phrase is this, create towards what you contend for. And if you don't know what contend means, contend means what you claim, what you are going after. And so in simple terms, make decisions towards what you want to see in your life. And so I'll, as I was going through that section of the book, I know I want to create, I want to make the most out of the life I have, but I'm too afraid to create. I'm too afraid to take the step. So I was like, why am I allowing myself to be stuck in my head? And why am I allowing myself to just think of all the reasons why it won't work, why it's not gonna happen, when I should just do the very best I can with what I have? And so <laughs> that's exactly what right now, you know, I might not even uh, share the thoughts in the best way, or I might not have like the best setup and all that, but I'm like, I want to take the time right now to do the very best I can with what I have. I want to take the time to be honest and I want to take the time as well, personally, just to create. But then secondly, maybe challenge some of you also who are stuck in that same mindset where before you even try, you already give yourself all the reasons as to why it's not going to happen. And you know, it might look different for you. It might be a certain job or it might be a certain relationship or you know, just some goal that you know you want, 
you know you want to reach, you know you want to see. But then for some reason, your mind is playing all of these games on you and you find yourself stuck. And for someone like me, again, that values what the Bible says, one of the reasons why it says that you can be strong and courageous is because God is with you. And then another thing is, it has the challenge. Yes, God is with you, but also you have to be willing to do the work. If you want to see something different in your life, you have to try doing something different. And in this case, it's not staying stuck by fear and your thoughts, but it's actually creating in spite of all of these feelings and thoughts that might try to bring you down. So that's something I'm trying to do. This video is the start of that. And I do want to create more. And I hope that you learned something even from this video. If there's something that you want to create and you want to see in your life, share it in the comments, share maybe what you've been struggling with. Um, share if there's something you've learned from this. And also I'd appreciate it if this video did help you, if you give it a like, a subscribe, and maybe you can also tell me certain things that you'd want me to talk about more. And I'll do the very best I can to actually make it happen and, and create.